Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of Baker McKenzie, it's my absolute honor and pleasure to welcome you here today for what I hope will be an impact event. My name is Eva Maria Sigur Kabanak. I'm a partner in the Vienna office of Baker McKenzie and head our Austrian capital markets practice. Climate change is clearly the biggest challenge mankind is facing. Sustainable finance is at the very core of discussions around climate change mitigation. The financial industry, if you will, is being called to help save our planet. By mere coincidence, the timing of our event today is aligned with the UN Climate Summit and New York Climate Week. This week, public and private sector leaders from around the world are gathering in New York to discuss solutions to the climate crisis with sustainable finance being very high up on the agenda. We have come up with the idea for today's event because we are convinced that we are not talking about one of many trends that come and go. We are talking about a fundamental change in the way our financial system and our economy as a whole work. With the adoption of the UN Sustainable Development Goals and the Paris Climate Agreement, one-dimensional, short-term maximizing of profits is no longer a viable option for companies. ESG, environmental, social, and governance factors gain more and more significance for investors, customers, employees, and the public. Today's event is structured so that we can take a very comprehensive look at sustainable finance in Europe and beyond. In 2018, the EU Commission has rolled out an ambitious action plan intended to close an estimated investment gap of approximately 180 billion euros per year, starting from now to achieve the EU climate and energy targets by 2030. We will get detailed insights into the action plan from distinguished experts and discuss the outlook and implications for national policymakers and the industry, as well as the concrete regulatory implications for financial institutions. While our morning sessions will focus on developments within the EU, our panels later on, starting with our panel on green bonds, have a more global reach. And I'm very proud to say that with me in this room are not only partners and colleagues of mine from many of our European offices, but also partners and colleagues from a number of offices around the globe, including from North America, Asia, Africa, and Latin America. We will have the privilege to have some of them give us an update on current trends in sustainable finance in their respective regions. We have a very dense program ahead of us, um, but let me stress once more that as Baker McKenzie, we're excited to be here today to engage with an impressive number of distinguished external speakers and an extremely diverse audience from Austria and abroad, covering representatives from financial institutions, energy companies, other corporates, as well as regulators, government agencies, international organizations, and other stakeholders. I do encourage all of you to take a very active part in the discussions today and share your experience and perspective. We hope that today's event will make an impact. For many years, Baker McKenzie has been at the forefront of advising governments, businesses, and financial institutions in connection with climate change issues. We want to continue being at the forefront and shaping the discussion on sustainable finance. And I'm convinced that all of you will join us in this journey within your respective organizations. With that, I would like to now hand over to my partner, Christopher Jones, who will be leading us uh, through our first session on the EU Action Plan. Chris has joined us last year after a career of over 30 years at the European Commission, where he designed and implemented Europe's energy policy. We're very proud to have you here, Chris. The floor is all yours. Thank you. 